I remember when I first got to MIT and I was so excited to see the truly cutting edge work being done in robotics. You know, the robots that we've been told over and over again are gonna take everyone's jobs and take over the world. Uh, and I quickly discovered that there's a massive discrepancy between the public perception of where the world is in robotics and where we actually are. So from what I've seen, trust me, for most robots, if you ever feel threatened, you can just dump a bucket of water over them and you should be absolutely fine. Now, that's not to say that we shouldn't be thinking about what robots mean for the future of work, for the future of humanity. That's something that I think about a lot. I just come at it from a slightly different perspective on our future. And that starts with a unique aspect of robots that I am especially interested in, which is our self-projection. For example, something that I think is fascinating is the fact that there's a Japanese manufacturing company that will have its employees do exercises in the morning to warm up their bodies for their day on the assembly line. And this company, which also has robots working in the factory, will have the robots do the same exercises with their arms in order to be perceived more like colleagues and less as machines. Isn't that a little bit weird? Or I think it's interesting that when Boston Dynamics released the following video, everyone in robotics watched this video and said, wow, the robot didn't fall over. But then there were quite a lot of other people who watched this who expressed more negative emotions about what was happening in the video. Um, and it actually got to the point where PETA, the animal rights organization, was getting so many phone calls that they had to issue a press statement. Now, PETA didn't really care much about this. They said they weren't gonna lose any sleep over this because it wasn't a real dog. But I'm interested in this. I am interested in the fact that despite all knowledge to the contrary, people will consciously or subconsciously treat robots like living things.